Welcome back guys to another video for Resident Evil 4. This is chapter 4-4 and grab that handgun ammo to begin with and try pay attention to begin with guys because there's a lot going on here. So you come down these steps and it'll trigger the enemies, there we go. After you trigger them, come back up, get past him, try and bait his attacks so you get past him safer. Smash this pot, get the velvet blue from inside, that's always in there. And then climb this ladder, you can smash this pot in front, there's sometimes something inside not always, I got coins this time. And then come around this side so that enemies are keeping away from you. And jump to this hand when it comes down. Then quickly shoot that lever just there. Shoot that lever on the front of the statue. And what that do, this hand lift do it on. It will lock it in the up position. It will stop it from working. And that's great. It means no other enemies can follow you. So let's get rid of these guys. Yep. And then what we're going to do, we're going to pull that lever just over there. Once you got rid of them. Yeah, suplex. Go for the suplex if you can. Yeah, see that enemy? Shoot him. Just get their attention. And then they'll start moving towards you. Just want to get their attention. Don't worry, they can't actually get you yet. Yeah, sorry. Pull this lever here. I already mentioned this, but yeah, that lever. Pull that lever. That's one of two. Yeah, then before you jump back to the hand, see these guys. I'm going to shoot them so they fall down. If they're not near the edge, they won't fall off. So just one bullet. Yeah, just wait for them to get near the edge. There we go, and then jump to hand, and then jump off it, you land in the middle, and then on this far hand, jump over to here. Get his two pots, the floor above us, there's not really anything there by the way, just a few pots, normally have nothing inside. Yeah here, drop down ladder, and then kill this red guy. He may not, he may be a bit closer to the ladder by the way, so just be cautious of that. And so, as long as you only shot the levers on the statue, which I did, the enemy shouldn't be able to follow you. And once you're down here, kill the enemy, loot the area. Pull that lever and it'll spawn a load more enemies. Jump, climb up that ladder to get away from them quickly. And then jump over to his hand when it comes back down. And then jump to the middle. Yeah, jump to the middle there. And then from the middle, jump off forward. That's it. And you should avoid all the enemies doing that and automatically start the next scene. So here, you've just got a few Q QTEs. You have square to sprint and then L2 to dodge you have to dodge left and then right and then press both dodge together and then quickly break this lock that's it and come through another little cutscene straight after still chasing you the huge baby that's it and it'll, it'll trip over banana skin that you left that's it yeah that's it try and climb up with a TMP in your hand that's really going to help and they come first door. Yeah, so this is the um, dreaded elevator sequence. Yeah, to begin you have cutscene and a QTE, so just be ready flat. You see me? Dive, dodging that knife. Got to be quick to catch me off guard. Yeah, grab the hangar bullets and come around here. You get a yellow herb in this chest. That's it, once you've got that, gonna make our way up the steps. Be very careful here, because soon some barrels gonna stop, start rolling down. As long as you be quick, yeah, once you start, yeah, barrel's going to start rolling down now, so be very quick and should be able to miss them. Come up a bit more and take the first path on your left. You just see it there, the flaming barrel? Yeah, take the path on your left, it'll bring you out here. And I'm going to use a bit of ammo now, because I actually want to get my ammo used up, because I want to be upgrading my capacity um, a little bit next time. Yeah, so don't be shy about using all your TMP ammo or all your shotgun ammo in this bit. But you're going to be using your shotgun on the elevator. So yeah, try and use your TMP leading up to it. And then we'll try and save our striker ammo for the elevator. Normally, with the capacity our striker is currently at, you should be able to just make it last for the elevator fight so they can upgrade capacity again on the next one. I activated the um, flaming barrel there so that one rolls down the steps and kills the enemies that just spawned at the bottom making their way up. And I've come up here, kill that enemy with a uh, little dynamite, and then grab a green herb. Yeah, just checking there's crossbow enemies, because when you start the elevator, two crossbow enemies spawn. I just seen if they spawn there already. Yeah, so it, over here, just grab the barrels now that you kill that dynamite throwing enemy. Grab the shotgun shells, whatever, the fire grenade, and then whatever came out from that barrel. Too many fire grenades, I did not need all them. Bloody hell. Is that, is that 15 incendiary grenades? Whoa. It's almost close, it's close to that. Yes, yeah, so I'm just trying to make some space. And then what you want to do, 
push off these two crates so the elevator can actually move. Yeah, push them both off. Leon's a heavy bastard. You can't be on the lift at the same time as crates. Yeah, then press the switch to start it. Yeah, keep your TMP ready just for time being. Get rid of that crossbow enemy straight opposite the button you pressed to activate it. And then run to your opposite side, turn around and shoot this crossbow enemy on the same side as the button. That's it. Once you've got two crossbow enemies, you can get rid of the enemies as they jump in. So don't let too, en too many enemies get on the lift at once because it'll make it stop. I think it's three. Yeah, so as soon as they spawn in, try to kill them straight away. And yeah, I'm using my TMP ammo, like I said, I want to upgrade capacity. So I'm just going to use it until I've got zero, but I'm not going to reload. Yeah, so make sure you don't reload. There we go, got zero. So I'm going to switch over to a striker now. Start using that. I've got ten with this. So I'm going to have to be careful not to use all these up. Might, looks like I might have to reload it once, at least. Yeah, going to have to reload it once. I think the lift, yeah, lift stop then. See what will happen, the lift will stop if too many enemies get onto the lift. Yeah, it's still dropping down. So you should be able to reload once with the striker. Use TMP ammo until you got zero. Then switch to striker. Use it until you have to reload once. Then reload once. And then you should be able to finish them off with the whatever you reload on the second time. There we go. Got five bullets left, so I'm not going to be wasting too many. Even if I do upgrade capacity now. Right, once at the top, just follow the path around. Grab any loot on your way past. There'll be treasure near the end. You can actually see it on the map if you bought the treasure map. Yeah, I don't know who broke that barrel. Yeah, so just near the exit, you have to go right. Yeah, don't forget this red herb hidden in the corner here. Yeah, you see that little land, that little burning torch? Yeah, drop down here, and there's a chest of the treasure. It's quite deceiving in this room, the um, actual icon on the on the map, if you've bought the treasure map, because it looks like it's on the steps, but don't quite show what floor. But yeah, it's actually right at the top of the area. Yeah, then activate this elevator. And going to be fighting the boss in a minute, guys, and it'll pop a trophy. It's been quite a while since we've got a trophy on this. Yeah, come all the way to the top, and there'll be a merchant up here. So if you haven't, I think I do have... Yeah, grab a loot first. Oh, no, I don't. I was going to say, you want to buy a rocket launcher. Yeah, so if you, ha if you haven't got a rocket launcher, you want to buy one here. Yeah, so just sell any junk. You don't need, obviously, handgun ammo and rifle ammo. And green, red and yellow mixes. And any green herbs mix with three at once. Yeah, any three green herb mixes at once. Three green herbs mixed together. They sell for the most out of... If you're selling, try and sell only green herbs. They sell more when you've got three mixed together. Yeah, right. Well, I don't know how I'm going to make space for a rocket launcher. But I'm going to have a go. Right, so a few of them, get rid of a stack, 26, um, 12 incendiary grenades, fuck. Now, yeah, flash grenades, you want to keep them, guys. I sold them here, but they would have come in useful in the last chapter, last few chapters, so yeah. I'd advise keeping the flash grenades and just sell this incendiary and some of the hand grenades. Fire grenades, I honestly don't really use anymore at all. So, I just try and keep a nice stock of each. And then sell all your treasure, which is not complete. Uh, sorry, which... Well, it's, it's, it's complete, sorry. Yeah, then once you're ready, you going to buy a rocket launcher. Yeah, thank you. Let's do it. Rocket launcher, baby. Yeah, I'm going to have to organise my bloody inventory again. Bit of a mess. You must get loads of ammo on the last chapter for me to end up with like a thousand TMP and like two or three hundred shotgun ammo and about 40 magnum. Yeah, you must end up with loads. You don't get many more flash grenades though. That's why you want to try and keep your flash grenades. Yeah, I'm going to have one upside down grenade. 
Yeah, this boss we're about to face, you can, depending on what difficulty your modify, your dynamic difficulty it's on, you can kill him with just one rocket, um, but sometimes it doesn't work, and if it doesn't work, you'll just do it the way I'm going to show you. Where you shoot the eye with the magnum, and that'll make Salazar appear, and you just shoot him with the rocket, and it's game over for him. And the trophy will go ding, and you'll finish your chapter. Right, we're good to go. Love the rocket launcher in there. <laughs> Thank you. What are you, Thank you. Yeah, you rifle ammo. Got, forgot about that one. Right, what can I upgrade? Capacity? Yes, Is thank you. <laughs> and TMP? No. What are you buying? Oh, no. I, no, I can't even upgrade TMP, bollocks. Right. Let's do it, guys. So, yeah, save your game once you're ready if you want to. And then head into the boss door. Yeah, so straight away, run over to middle, the middle of the sort of um, ledge you're on. You can actually drop down, but no, stay on the ledge you're on. Run to the middle, and then shoot the eye when it gets close. You may there may be QTE if there is, just dodge it and then run back to the middle. Shoot the eye up close the magnum, and then shoot Salazar when he appears with a rocket launcher. And like I say, game over. That's it, guys. Very simple fight. Yeah, it's a lot of loot in the area now. Probably, well, no, I will have space because um, the rocket launcher's been used up. Yeah, you get a trophy there. The Castellan Force. Yeah, so grab all the loot before you leave. Yeah, he's got herb there. Green herb. Handgun ammo. Over here, you have some shotgun ammo. Yeah, drop down afterwards. Don't be too long because I think that treasure might disappear where Salazar died. Yeah, so don't be too long. Yeah, grab loot from them barrels. The loot from these ones. Yeah, not done yet. Should be a few more barrels, I think. Yeah, two more here. And. Yeah, two more here, and that's it. Yeah, we'll head up, grab the gold that he dropped. And should be able to end the chapter. Yes, there, grab the gold. 50k, wow. Oh, yeah, not quite finished yet. Yeah, get these two barrels. And once you've got them, just follow on and grapple down this rope. Now, it's two barrels down. Well, is it two? Yeah, two barrels down here. One of them's got a snake inside, so be careful. Be ready to kill a snake. Ah, I got him. I must have hit him twice. Yeah, so there's a snake in that barrel on the right, so just be ready for him. And then operate this elevator. Yeah, this will take us down into the emergence area. After this, it's going to be an end of the chapter, by the way. And it's going to take us onto the island, the final sort of place where the last few chapters will take place. But there won't be a merchant for a little bit, so whatever you need to do, make sure you do it here now. Yeah, so just loot the area first, just like normal and sell any of your junk and try to organize your inventory as well i'm going to try and upgrade the tmp now can't remember if i upgrade the capacity now or not um we'll see in a second i think we can upgrade the exclusive now as well yeah which makes it so it goes from 1.2 to 1.8 firepower so for like 50 percent extra so what have i got i've got almost 600 ammo already bloody hell Yes, yeah, so I talked to merchants. What are you selling? Sell your handgun and rifle, like Thank always. You. And sell. you can sell a bit of your shotgun if you need to, Thank I guess. You. We're not going to need sell. all of it. We're going to get hundreds. The exclusive for a striker gives you 100 ammo. So, yeah, it gives you quite a lot. Yeah, so any treasure which is complete, you want to sell it. And right, see so what we can upgrade. So, broken butterfly, we can upgrade that a little bit more. Yep, striker, yeah, let's do it. Get capacity max and then we'll get the exclusive. Take it to firepower 1.8. So yeah, you want to get that exclusive now, guys, if you can. So you can use it in this next area. Equip it, yeah, don't shoot him. I'm gonna make a safe. And then chapter, guys. 
Yeah, so just make sure the Broken Butterfly, the Striker and the TMP, they are fully maxed, everything except for capacity. But the TMP obviously wants capacity maxed and exclusive. The TMP at this point should be fully upgraded, but everything else should be all fully upgraded except for sort of capacity, which you can't quite upgrade yet anyway on the other weapons. And the other stuff anyway. Yeah, only the TMP can fully upgrade right now. Yeah, so that's it guys, the end of chapter 4-4. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.